All right, we are back in the kitchen with Liz Bouchong, who has already made the cupcakes, which I have to say are worth every decadent calorie. They are, they are delicious. Good. She has been talking about those ever I since know, you gave her a taste know, just a moment ago. Well, you can so have one too. I'm going to have one here in just a little okay. bit. Yeah. Or you could sample her dessert board. Oh, yes. This is beautiful. It's gorgeous. And you know what's so fun about this? It's stuff that you can do today for tomorrow. I mean, right. this is all purchase stuff like Hostess Cakes and Little Debbie's and then the little cookies. We've got fresh strawberries in the middle and we've got chocolate truffles. And then what you do is you start, I kind of started with the outer layer mm -hmm. because I just think these hearts are just the cutest things ever. And they're, they're really cute. And they're, and they're just store bought. And, and they're store bought, yep. And then you just kind of section off your pieces. And then I bought these um, Russell Stover caramel candies, and I left those in the package because the package went so pretty with everything else. The only thing I made were the little cookies. Those are Linzer cookies. They're like little butter Ooh. cookies with um, a heart cut out with strawberry jam in the middle. Oh, nice. And I love and you got the little sugar. dipping there. Yes. yes, and that is chocolate for your strawberries. And these little things, these are um, strawberry cream marshmallows. Oh, Aren't that, isn't that nice. Those so are you nice. could dip that in chocolate if you want to. But these little dudes, I couldn't find Valentine, um, you know, right. toothpicks or right. whatever. So these are little cookies. Um, the heart shape that's out of the cookie is what this is. I baked it onto the uh, shortbread. Is shortbread. it like a shortbread? It How did you get the toothpick to stay in the shortbread? Well, I put it in oh, while you it was baked dough. it. Yes, together. and then wrap your little toothpick with foil so it doesn't burn. There you go. That is yeah. so smart. And then when it's dry, uh, dry. When it's cool, <laughs> dip it in your chocolate, and that's um, candy just... melt. Now that is some major effort. Yeah. For yeah. that beautiful little toothpick. But it's so cute, and then you can. <laughs> but dip if it's it for in somebody chocolate. you love. Then you gotta well, do yeah, it. Yeah, absolutely. So, oh, there you go. There you go. Oh. <laughs> Y'all just talk about it. Yes. Talk amongst yourselves. I love it. I and what I love too mm. is you yes. took a lot of different shapes and okay. sizes and put it together mm. with the you know the yes. long little straws there. Uh huh. And these are cookies too. They're they're foil wrapped. I bought those. And so mm. it's just going to the store, finding things that you absolutely love, what your family loves, what your boyfriend loves, whatever, and then just create a cute little tray. Now the neat thing about this board, I found this at Hobby. Lobby and it was the shape I wanted so I took it home and I sanded it and then I used a butcher block um, like mineral oil right. to seal it and so now I have a cheese board for later so I can oh, do this nice. every season and you can do this every season you can do Easter you know St. Patrick's Day whatever you and want. And your shortbread those little hearts you did a fantastic job on that shortbread. Thank you. It is the right texture and everything. So. Thank you. Ooh, did you eat it? Oh, I was it, it good? good? So good. Oh, it is good. Wait, you try the cupcake. <laughs> and you and you know yes. my wife loves marshmallows, so oh, I, I, I need I to get her some. Walmart. Of oh. Strawberry and strawberry and cream. But aren't they cute? Those are all the rage right now, are the yeah. fancy gourmet the flan marshmallows. The flavored marshmallows. Uh -huh. yes. So you could dip that in chocolate. That would be kind of cute too. And let that set. Wouldn't that be cute? You have your own little fondue thing going on. You <laughs> could, too, don't you? Yeah, go, Chris. Uh, and you want said, that too? Wait a minute. Ooh. It's, 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 it's about to drip. Oh, yes. he's got to go for it. Yeah. It's like sushi all in it's one bite. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And you Love said, it. Liz, go ahead yes. and kind of, in, well, I say invest, but these little dishes and things I are got, so versatile and inexpensive. Yes, yes. And they are microwavable, which is kind of nice. They get hot, but you have to be careful with that. And the strawberries, there's lots of strawberries this time of year with uh, dipping strawberries. And you could do that if you wanted to, but I thought there was enough things going on on the plate I didn't need to do more chocolate drizzle yes. so the key to the board is balancing it right and like I've got three different uh, dishes and that helps create symmetry and um, it's just fun. It's just fun. Fill in the extra spaces with little M&Ms. Yeah. You know what? It is fun to have you back. We've missed you. Thank Come see you. us again, okay? Oh. Hi, everybody. LizBouchong.com for more information <laughs> and other great tips. You can also find her on Pinterest and Instagram.